Hey guys, what's going on and welcome to day 2 of 22 days of lipstick and today's video has been requested by Miss Edata and girl I am so sorry it has taken me such a long time to put up this video but nevertheless today I'm going to be doing a lip swatch and a review of the Wet n Wild Mega Last Liquid Catsuit High Shine Lipstick. Oh my god, it is such a mouthful. And I have picked out three shades with me. As always, check out the description box below to see the shade names. And foundation shade reference, I am NC40 in MAC. Now, before we can go ahead with the lip swatch, the pros and cons and formulas, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it to notify whenever I upload. And now, let's jump right in the video. Okay, so I'm going to call this as the Wet n Wild High Shine Lipstick because remembering the whole name is like a task. It's a mouthful like I said before. So let's quickly talk about the features of this liquid lipstick. Now it says that it is a high shine liquid lipstick that delivers a mirror like gloss finish. Features brilliant intense shine and ultra pigmented formula. Vitamin E improves overall lip texture. Murumuru, which I like saying Murumuru. So Murumuru Seed Butter provides moisturization to your lipstick. Moisturization spelling is incorrect. There should be a Z and not an S. Just saying. I know it's annoying. <laughs> uh, so the Shea Butter gives the formula its smooth, creamy texture. Sunflower Seed, Passion Fruit Seed, Argan and Macadamia Oil provides moisture and nourishment. And this product is cruelty free, gluten free, fragrance free and it is vegan as well. Now the features sound amazing. It literally sounds like skincare but for your lips, you know. So everything looks and sounds extremely good. Now these are priced at 499 rupees for 5.7 grams of product. And in India there are only 4 shades that are available. So this is how the packaging looks like. At the bottom you have is a shade name and number. And this packaging is exactly identical to their matte liquid lipstick. It's just that the cap of this one is white in color. Of that one it is black in color. Even the Joe Foot applicator looks identical and everything is exactly the same okay and now let's move on to the lip swatches Alright, so let's talk about the formula and the pros of this liquid lipstick. Now this is super creamy and super pigmented. Now in my personal opinion, I feel like this is more like a gloss with full pigmentation and it is super shiny as well. Now it is extremely comfortable on your lips and it's very moisturizing as well. Like I mentioned in the features, there are such good ingredients in this lipstick. I feel like it's more like a skincare for your lips. You know? Now to get the full opacity, you do have to go over like two layers of it. Like this shade zero later that I'm wearing right now, just one layer is okay. But then for the darker shades, like the red and the uh, berry color that I applied, you have to go over twice to get the, to, uh, 
to get the full opacity of it and also even though like i mentioned it's more like a gloss i feel it lasts much more longer than a gloss because of how pigmented these are now if you do not have anything heavy to eat this will last for like about four to five ish hours and uh, if you do have a heavy meal this is how it looks like now you can see that the outside portion of it is still intact but the inner portion is completely gone so if you do press your lips together you get that very sheer tint of lipstick so yeah and also i love the fact that it is not sticky now when lipsticks are sticky that is the biggest con for me but these are really comfortable and it is creamy and it's nice now for a quick FII, now that's only because of the current situation that we are at right now with COVID, masks and everything. So please do be safe. But do not wear this lipstick with your mask on. It will be a huge mess because this lipstick is so rich and creamy. If you wear it over a mask, it will smudge all over your mouth area and that is not a good feeling at all. Just don't do it. So yeah, that is a quick FII for cons there is just one quick big con now that is the shade range now in india there are only four shades that are available but then in us they do offer about 12 shades like it's 2021 bring out all the shades why is there so conjuicy on the shades i don't understand that so yeah, these were my opinion and thoughts about the wet and wild mega last liquid catsuit high shine lipstick I said it. I did it. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it to so notify whenever I upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or requests, I will try my best out for you as well as follow me on my socials which is it's Shanair on Instagram and it's Shanair on Twitter as well. So until the next time, take care. Bye.